for numbers. Don't know why, why I'm going to say. Everyone must have this experience when you deliver a speech on this stage. And we all know the solution is to practice, practice, and practice. Practice can make us more confident on this stage. However, today I'm not going to, to talk about how to enhance your good delivered speech. I'm going to talk about how to manage your brain, how to enhance your memory, the memory. In biology, memory can divide into two parts, the short-term memory and the long-term memory. The short-term memory is the thing just happened and you just remember it. The long-term memory is the thing that you keep repeating in your brain and you will stay in your brain for long. Do you know how short is the memory it is? If I give you 10 random numbers and you remember it, and after one hour, there's only left four numbers. And after one day, they only left three numbers. So we are easy to forget things. And the tips to solve this problem is to keep repeat the things in your brain and you will remember it. However, for me, this doesn't work at working at all. I always start to repeat the things, but forgot first. This bothered me really a lot. One time, I buy a cake in the living room, and I need a fork to eat it. So I walk to the kitchen, and I just forgot what I'm going to take. Sounds ridiculous, but this is the truth. In order to solve this problem, I also found learn from others, like I write a note down or record in my smartphone. However, I will forget to check my cell phone, smartphone, and the notebook. So the result is the same. I still forgot the things. Last year, my friends suggested me to participate in a course. They declared that if you join this class, then you will remember the things more fast, more efficiently. Sounds like a magic job. So I decided to join this class. And now I'm going to share my experience to you. There are many ways to manage your brain and to enhance your memory. I will share two of them to do. One, first one is the imagination. If you are going to bring some Seem like a notebook, textbook, pencil box, and a smartphone. These four things. So you try to imagine there is a big hole on you, and there is a four big pocket. So you can put your uh, notebook inside your right pocket, and your textbook, and a pencil box, and your smartphone. So to remember this image, so when you are going out, you just recall this image, and you can remember these four things really easy. And the second, second thing, in Chinese we call that Suan uh, Ding Ba. Why use this name? Because just like a nail to stick on the things. And the thing must, we must use the thing that won't change forever. Like our body, our human body, we all have a head, two hands, two legs, and the body. So, you can link your thing you want to remember to our body. For example, like uh, we want to remember like apple, chairs, and uh, textbook. Okay, so I imagine that my head is an apple. <laughs> and my hand and my leg just like a chair. And my body just like a textbook. So, if I want to recall the image, so can, you can re remind from your head to your leg, so your apple, your chairs, and the textbook. It's easy to remember from your body. And also, if you want to remember more things, you can create like your eyes, your nose, your mouth. You can use all, all the things from your body, so you can remember a lot of things. Also, you can use the car. Car also won't change at all. You can link your the thing you want to remember to the cars. So these things can make you match your memory more easily. So use your creativity 
you make this imagination more ridiculous than you can remember it more easily. After I learn this method, you must want to ask me, is this method working on me or not? I would say, if you, go, you want to go to a convenience store or supermarket and buy a lot of things, yes, this method is working, working a lot. But for study, we all are work, working hard on study. And for me, my major is biology. Uh, there's always a lot of professional, difficult words and passwords I have to remember. And I find out that this method doesn't work at all. And also, if you have your own way on your study, I think mm, this method is, is, you don't need these methods. So, all in all, I think after, most importantly, after I learned these things, these methods, I, I realized one thing. There is no thing in this world that you cannot remember. Why would I say that? If I give you 100 rand on random numbers, I want you to remember. No tight limitation. You must say it's ridiculous. I can't remember all of it. But if I say, you remember this 100 number, I, I, will, I will give you 100 US million dollars. What will you say? <laughs> so, it depends on your attitude, your interest. If you are interested on in these things you want to remember, you can remember it really quickly. In the end, I cost a lot of money on this course. So, and share this with you. So, can I ask you to give me a big applause for return? Yeah! yeah. yeah.